Hello Simmers, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Kalia. You should hit that subscribe button while you're at it because I mean, why not? Help a girl out, okay? We on the road to 100K. So just hit that subscribe button, it's free and it takes like a one second. So you guys, I'm super excited. My game has not been working for like the past couple of days and I know I'm not alone because every time a new pack comes out, they give us a patch and everyone's game is broken. But I took the time out, I fixed my game and we are here with the Sims 4 Cottage Living. Cottage Living just hit the Sims streets. The streets are saying it's hot, but I'm gonna be the judge of that today, okay? If you don't have Cottage Living yet, make sure you head on over to Instant Gaming. If you don't know what Instant Gaming is yet, I'm about to put you on Sims. Instant Gaming is a website where you can get games at a discounted price. I get all of my Sims for expansion and game packs from Instant Gaming. So make sure you head on over to Instant Gaming to pick up your copy of Cottage Living. Or if you just want some new expansion packs, head on over to Instant Gaming. The link is right there in the description for your convenience. So head on over and start saving some money today. Now that that's out of the way, welcome to my Sims 4 Cottage Living Let's Play. I was not excited for this pack when it was first announced. I'm still not excited for the pack. I am excited to complain. I love complaining, especially when it comes to the Sims 4 because bullying works. All these other Simmers be trying to be nice to EA. I'm not about that. I feel like if we all collectively just started bullying them, then they would act right. And I guess I am a hypocrite because I keep complaining about the quality of packs, but I keep buying them. But it's like, how else am I supposed to know how shitty it is if I don't see for myself, right? Duh. Let's get this thing started. We are here with the main characters. Well, two of our main characters of this Let's Play. This is Courtney McCallum and this is Taylor McCallum. And if you've seen the Disney Channel movie Cow Bells, then this is who these Sims are based off of. If you've never seen the movie Cow Bells, how old are you? If you've never seen the movie Cow Bells, like are you like 10? But on a serious note, if you guys haven't seen Cow Bells, it's on Disney Plus. So if you have Disney Plus, you can go watch it right now. And it's a really good movie for the girls, okay? A nice little form movie. In the movie Cow Bells, there's two sisters, Taylor and Courtney, and they're super spoiled because their dad is the owner of a dairy plant. He makes them start earning money for once in their life by working at the dairy plant. That's what we're gonna do with these girls. Of course, we don't have a dairy plant. But, ta-da, we have our grandmother. And sorry, y'all, I don't know why she looks like this right now. I guess I just paused her at a bad time. <laughs> this is their grandma, Tammy. And grandma, she don't play. Y'all can't see, but she got a chest tat. She tatted up, like, she be chewing tobacco. She be smoking weed. Back in her days, she used to rob and shoot people. So yeah, now granny, she back on a the farm. Their dad sent them to live with their grandma to teach them a lesson. As you guys can see, they're looking very pristine see their hair is freshly done we got the ice on we got the louis purses we got the slides on and they look completely out of place in what is this world called what is a henry on bagel no what is it called henford henford on bagley right i don't know who came up with that name but girl we just go i'm not gonna say nothing okay i did make a cast video making this household so make sure you check it out if you haven't already so that way you can know more about them kind of sort of so make sure you check it out if you haven't already the link is right there in the corner i just made them talk a little bit about their story and kind of built off of what i told you guys they're just some wild spoiled teenagers and they about to get taught a lesson so this is where we will be staying in this let's play and no I did not build this I found it on the gallery these are the details so yeah it's called Casa Grande de Fazenda I'm sorry y'all I'm bilingual but I don't speak Spanish I just speak English and bad bitch but for, for all I did to find this lot I just clicked on lots 
I did 50 by 40 because that's the size of the lot that we're on right now. And then I did residential. Then I did popular now. And I just went through and see it's right here. Like you don't even have to scroll that much. So yeah, like a million and one other people are using this house right now, but I don't care. I'm not a fan of cottage core aesthetic. I'm not a fan at all. So yeah, I just picked a house, but let's get this thing started. First of all, let's turn the lights on because yeah, we don't have no power right now house dark as hell the only light we got is the natural sunlight so let's turn our power on real quick so we got these different packages i'm gonna just get the full welcome home i picked this one because i usually pick this one but i want the girls to be like ah, wow she doesn't even have all the channels here like wow what are we supposed to watch we can't even watch bad sims club and the reception here is so bad so i legit have no idea where to start i usually have a plan for the first episode of my let's plays but i just kind of wanted to see what cottage living was about so i just jumped right in but yo look we got chickens actually i know what we're gonna do i'm gonna have her purchase seeds okay oh yeah so look I think we're gonna start planting crops um and I'm gonna have the girls get acquainted with the farm it's gonna be so funny but I do want the grandma to grow some weed <laughs> because that's fun you know and hello is it a lol Kalia let's play if there's no weed it's not and we got some new crops with cottage living so we can have oversized crops they want to be Stardew Valley so badly with this pack. All right, so I think I want to buy everything. <laughs> I'm going to get two of each. And uh, just because I want to see what's going on. And we got different fertilizers. So we got hassle-free fertilizer and vitality fertilizer. Oh, okay, it's exactly what it sounds like. If you want to keep weeds and bugs away, then just sprinkle it over. And then this one is like when your crops are looking dry or if you want to increase the quality of your crops. So actually, I'm going to get, yeah, I'm going to get five of each. So let's start planting these crops, shall we? I'm going to start with the oversized ones. And I'm going to put, oh, wait, how do you do it? Oh, okay, okay. I see, I see what we're doing here. All right. So we're going to have grams start um, planting crops. And the girl, look, she over here taking selfies. She yawning. <laughs> and look, she's about to go watch TV. Like, sister, please. I don't know. Should I, should I pet the rooster? I don't know. Uh-uh, this rooster need to shut the fuck up. Okay, discuss preening methods. Y'all, look at all the chickens. They look so out of place <laughs> on this farm. Like, I'm really dead. She pet. Y'all, she pet the chicken once and she left. She said, girl, bye. I'm stepping out. <gasps> Look, there's ducks. Oh, cute. And we got a pond. <gasps> Bunnies. Hold on, wait. I want to say hi to the bunny. Oh, not Graham's bad to be mean. Oh, not the girl's beefing already. She didn't, She told her granddaughter to get off her lawn. How you gonna tell your granddaughter to get off your lawn? Y'all, she really out here beefing her granddaughters already. We just got here. Oh my god. Kumba, Mooney, Plevar. Uh oh. Finally. Y'all, now she beefing her granddaughters. Okay. Sparza Flinko. Right. Tell her to chill out. Like, girl, acting like that for what? <laughs> Look at them. No, because I'm so dead already. Oh, she's so rude. Y'all, Gramps is rude. What the heck? Darn kids. You heard me. Get off the lawn. So she a mean old lady. Oh, that's how you plant them. I didn't even get to see her plant that. Y'all, I don't know what's going on, okay? Don't judge me. Let's have her plant some more because she over here trying to beef with her um granddaughter. She needs something to do. And y'all need to stop watching TV. Y'all need to be outside. Come on, come get some fresh air. Y'all supposed to say hi to the bunnies. And look, we got a llama. And yeah, you, you say hi to the llama. Talk about llama e economics. And we got a cow. 
Ew, this cow. Mm, let me shut up. Before the animal lovers start um, beefing with me. Yeah, we putting them girls to work. Come feed the animals. And let's... Ooh, let's clean the llama. <laughs> I really wish we had a hates outdoors trait. And what the heck is this? Oh, wild birds? Oh my god. That llama got some chompers on him. Talk to the cow. Come pet the cow. Can you pet the cow? Oh, milk the cow. Let's see them milk the cow. Look at them. Them girls are put to work. And she over here bored <laughs> from doing this. Let me see milk the cow, sister. Ew. Uh, this is just so, I don't know. Milking cows is just nasty to me. But yeah, let me have Grams plant her weed because she gonna need it messing with these girls. Everyone keep trying to watch TV. No, no TV. We're spending time together as a family. Now, come on. Come share the llama's wool. And apparently you can't plant other stuff on this thing. And I hate that. Like, why not? What the heck? So yeah, now I have to plant my weed over here. I was trying to plant it right here, but it really it dead ass will not. I guess you can only plant overgrown plants on these and the Sims team is annoying me with that. Like I don't like that. Okay, y'all. So like don't hate me or anything, but I keep having to close the game and open it back up. The sound is going in and out. Ever since this update, a lot of people are having this problem. If you guys are having this problem as well, please leave a comment because I'm over here thinking my headphones are broke or my computer's broken. And no, it's just this game is dumb. Like, what the heck? And... Girl, that is not our front door. I guess we having a little housewoman party, but this is our front door. She over here knocking on the barn. Does she look dumb as hell? Cecilia Kang. We was Kangs. All right, let me greet my new neighbor. Let me say hello. And actually, I want her to leave <laughs> because I want to go into town. I want to explore because I'm bored. Just planting shit. Hopefully, Granny don't start beefing with the neighbor. Uh-uh, not this outfit. Y'all, look at her boots. Mm -mm, we need to give Cecilia a makeover ASAP. Okay, did she even bring food? Did she bring us something to eat? She didn't. She ain't bring us shit. Girl, gone. Get out of my fucking house. I'm about to cuss her out. She came empty handed. She over here knocking on my barn. Like, girl, bye. Get out of my face for real. Anyway, let's go exploring. We about to go to town. Or whatever. We're gonna bring the girls with us. And we're gonna see what's popping. Okay, I gotta see everything that's good with Henry on Bagel. Alright, y'all, we in town. So this is the tavern. Okay, cute. This is the pub owner. Huh. Wait, let's introduce ourselves to the pub owner. Cause Grams might be out here. So let me do a friendly introduction. What else they got over here? Oh, we got a stall. We got a grocery shop. Damn, this doesn't work. Okay, that's disappointing. Oh, window shop. I like shopping. Okay, and I'm gonna have her window shop over here. You can window shop over here too. What are these stores? Is this like a clothing store? So I guess this is a clothing store. And I don't know what you would buy here, but hold up, Agatha Crumplebottom. Oh, Miss Crumplebottom, black now. Oh, okay, period. Yeah, Boy, where the? He a young adult? Uh, uh. He is too young to be balding like this. Wait, is he balding? He is. How you a young adult and you don't got no hair in the middle of your head? Uh, uh. I don't trust him. You can't trust young people who bald. This is it. This is all window shopping is. Do you get something else? Like, do you get something from window shopping? That's it? Child, what is even the point of this? I'm gonna let them do their little window shopping. All right, let's talk to Miss Crumplebottom. Let's introduce ourselves. How do they get all these friends over here? Okay. The girl's making friends. Oh, he's a teen. Let's introduce ourselves to him. I wish we could give a snooty introduction. Like, we should be able to do that. 
And y'all, you don't get nothing from window shopping. Retail therapy. Wow. That's all that happens. Oh, Taylor has noticed Raul's eyes. Boy, look how you dressed. I don't want to talk to you. Like, y'all, why does he think he can talk to my sister? Look at them and look at him. It's the audacity for me. If it's one thing men gonna have, it's the audacity. Like, boy, boy, get out of here. Oh, not him feeling flirty. Boy, she think he's a nature maniac. <laughs> ah, one of these tree hugging, broccoli eating, beach walking. The Sims that think it's their duty to criticize others every life choices because they're less green than their own or less healthy. Be that true or not. Okay, so basically she think he dirty because he be outside. They really still talking to this little boy? Grocery deliverer. Wait, so when we order groceries, he gonna be popping up at our house? See, I don't like that. Offer help with errands. Oh no, never mind, never mind, never mind. I don't want help. Mm -mm, I just wanted to click. <laughs> I don't want to help. Here, let's buy some groceries from this lady. Did you introduce yourself? Oh, okay. Let me buy some items from Miss Crumple Bottom. Yeah, so you can get apple jam. Oh, you can buy wool. Oh, choco berry. Oh, and you can buy treats over here too. What does a glow orb do? This is just a whole bunch of shit. Oh, okay, I wanna cross stitch hoop. Oh, tomato sauce. And I don't know what kind of treats to get my um my animals. Ooh, friendly treat, healthy treat, pumpkin treat. Ooh, animals that eat this treat produce orange eggs, pumpkin spice milk, and orange wool. Okay. I like that. Green eggs. Oh, we can make green eggs and ham. All right, I'm gonna get these treats. Yeah, period. And do I want to plant other stuff? I should, right? I do want one of those um trees that grow these. So I should get one. Yeah, I think that's it. I don't want anything else. I kind of have a lot of this stuff already. Is she buying groceries? Okay, so we can buy cheese, milk, fire milk. What the hell is that? Hold on, wait, I'm gonna get it. This is a grocery store? They barely got anything here. Like, what kind of groceries is these? Nah, we should open up our own. Stop talking to me. Y'all, they finally see some hot people in Henford on Bagel. And they sitting up here trying to talk to me like, y'all is pressed. Well, can I drink this? I want to see how, I want to see what it does. Whoo, <laughs> that thing on fire. Ooh! <laughs> that girl got the bubble guts. Ew, why would they get spicy milk? And I guess now we have like this little, these little notebooks or whatever. And she is just talking to anybody. Taylor, like she is dead ass making friends with everyone. I'm gonna read this. Read about the Fenchwick Fair. And I wanna learn about these villagers or whatever. Ooh! Y'all hear that girl's stomach? <laughs> Ew. Okay, so you can have a chicken competition, an egg competition. You can win ribbons, purchase items. Okay, and it's Saturday. Damn, it's Sunday right now. All right, let me learn about the villagers. Oh, okay, so there's Agatha and Agnes. Okay, I thought Agnes wasn't here. Agnes, the one who we be beefing with. Wait, how her cousin black? They said this Agnes cousin who co-owned, like, how is her cousin black? <laughs> Whatever. Oh, that was the mayor we were talking to. Okay, and he's the creature keeper. He looked like it. A little weird ass. These are the locals. Y'all, Courtney, her butt hot as hell. I know it is. Wait, but that's it? That's all we can do over here? Um, this is, that's boring. Like, hello? See, now I'm getting mad, but okay, whatever. We just gonna go back home and I think we can like cook together now. So let's try, we're gonna make a little family meal. That's their dad, but I ain't feel like making him a cast. So one day we gonna give him a makeover for real. Right now he looking like, uh, <laughs> looking like a townie. But okay, yeah, let's all go home and let's try this little group cooking thing that came with Cottage Living. All right, so we back home. And the girls are starving, as we can see. So let's start cooking. Let's see what we can cook. I don't know if we can. Oh, look, cook together with. There we go. And let's see what we can make together. 
Let's make some, ooh, not cheese. <laughs> we can make whole wheat things now, that's cute. All right, let's make, I don't know, we need something like good for, it's like Sunday dinner, you know, but our cooking skill not high enough. So let's do garlic noodles though. Hopefully they all get along in the kitchen. We making Sunday dinner together. <laughs> oh, poor Courtney. Y'all, I shouldn't have gave Courtney that milk. Sis really got the bubble guts. Oh, a picnic basket. We can have a picnic now, can't we? And this too, doesn't this work? Oh no, it doesn't. <laughs> I'm sorry, that sound of her bubble guts kills me every time. Aww. It was a meal we all made together. Yes, family dinner. And we're gonna sit down and we're gonna eat. Hashtag Sunday dinner. They look miserable. <laughs> they are miserable being at their grandmother's house, especially Courtney. Ooh, Why nobody talking at the table? Not everyone eating in silence. Tensions are high. Courtney can't even finish her food. Her stomach hurt. Come on, one more scoop, sis. You got this. Like, I am really dead. I'm sorry. And what are you doing? Girl, you look weird. And yeah, Courtney about to go cry in the bed. Ugh, poor Courtney. And I'm gonna have my sis put this way. She over here taking selfies. Like, girl, now is not the time. <laughs> but okay, it's actually time for them to sleep, though. To be honest. They got school tomorrow. It's their first day of school in their new house with their grandma. Oh my god, look at this dinosaur, y'all. Now they know they dead wrong. What the fuck is this? Uh, I didn't even know such a contraption existed at one point in time. What the hell? And I do need to give this house a makeover. It's just that, ugh. I, can I do country living decor? Oh man, I forgot to get the mod where they can sleep together. But like, come on, you guys are sisters. Because, okay, whatever. You just gonna have to sleep in this room, Taylor. I'm sorry, sis. I wanted them to sleep together, but I gotta um, give them new rooms. And y'all done smashed the dollhouse. Okay, thanks for that, you guys. Love that. I hope you guys enjoyed the first part of the Cowbells LP. Y'all already know how the first episodes of LPs be. They be kind of slow, but next episode, we gonna be back and we gonna be lit. And that's on period. I don't know what we're going to do yet, but I'm going to come up with something, okay? So, yeah. Leave a comment. Tell me what you guys thought. And I will see you guys in part two of our Cottage Living Let's Play, okay? I love you guys. Bye.